Team 2 forecast. Well, overnight we did have a few passing showers, so if you're heading out early this morning and you notice that the roadway is still a little damp, that's the reason why. But now the rain has pretty much cleared our area and we are left with a lot of clouds out there. As we take a look here at the satellite and radar together, you can see lots of clouds extend back to our west as well. And throughout the morning, we'll see cloudy skies, but we'll see an increase in the sunshine come later on this afternoon. So we will have improving weather conditions. And if you're planning your weekend here, today is definitely going to be the better part part of the weekend. Clouds are going to return tonight and they may even bring in a few showers mainly during the overnight hours. Sunday though looks soggy with heavy rain possible especially as we go into the afternoon. So if you're headed out and about today, today's definitely the day to pick the pumpkins as temperatures will be around 60 degrees. Sunday though rain is likely even though it'll be a little bit warmer with highs in the mid 60s. The rainfall forecast here shows that during the day today no problems, but overnight tonight into Sunday we'll start to see the rain increase especially tomorrow afternoon and that rain could become heavy at times some locations could pick up anywhere from two to three inches of rain over the next couple of days we'll see uh, chances for rain increase sunday and continue into monday then dry weather is going to push into the area for a day on tuesday as we look outside right now we do have mainly cloudy skies across the miami valley 48 degrees northwest winds at seven miles an hour and the barometer is currently at 30.03 inches temperatures range from 45 in wapakoneta this morning to 50 degrees in Springboro as well as in Wilmington, 45 right now in Richmond. And today, just one more week before Halloween. So if you need to get that pumpkin today, uh, temperatures rising into the upper 50s by 2 o'clock. 6 o'clock, we're looking at 57 degrees. And if you're thinking about a bonfire later tonight, it looks pretty good. There is a very low chance that we could see a spotty shower, but that would be pretty late if you're having that bonfire like around 10, 11 o'clock at night. The wind should be light and temperatures will continue to drop into the upper 40s. Future tracks showing some sunshine developing later this afternoon, but the clouds will roll back in overnight tonight. Then we'll see a few showers develop by tomorrow morning, and then tomorrow afternoon we'll start to see heavier downpours possible, maybe even a thunderstorm or two. So today, the better of the two days with a high of 60 degrees. Tonight, though, we'll see mostly cloudy skies, overnight low of 48, and a few showers developing. Tomorrow looks rather soggy, especially tomorrow afternoon. A few isolated storms, high of 66. Your extended Storm Team 2 forecast here dry weather on Tuesday with a high of 56 and then we'll see rain chances start to increase again once again Wednesday, Thursday and Friday of next week with highs in the 50s. And of course